Let's go, Hayes. 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 My girl ain't allowed to say thank you to no other man. I'm the only one blessing her. You can understand my situation. This hairstyle makes me feel like. Honey, I do nails for you. Honey, you look it like a man. I do your nails, you can get a man. You have no kids? Oh, honey, I know why. Hey y'all, it's your girl Delight for Ace. I'm back in the building. What's up, what's goody? How are you? Yes, let's get into this hairstyle, people. Yes. So let's jump right into it. So this is Janet Collection Pixie Cut. This is 100% virgin hair. Yes. Okay. This is their 38 pieces. Plus four pieces of eight inches, and it is a one pack solution, and it came with a closure as well. All right, guys, so I did this hair myself, okay? This is my first time making a 38 piece unit. Like, this was so difficult. I didn't know there were so many pieces in 38 pieces, hence why it's called a 38 piece, so I didn't even realize. Okay, all right. I think I want to just put this on because it looks super cute. So this hair is from Janet Collection. Um, how do I feel about this hair? This is the back. Okay, I made a video for you guys. It's probably not going to be the best video of how I created this wig because I did not know what I was doing at all. Like, but... I think I did pretty alright for it being my first time making this kind of wig. I didn't realize that it came in different lengths until like halfway through me finishing the hair and I was just like, yo, why is this piece shorter than the other piece? Why is that piece so long? Forewarning guys, for somebody who first time making a 38 piece, it, piece wig, it comes in layers. Unknown to me, I did not know. It's not going to be the best video. I didn't know what the heck I was doing. But as you can see, you know, with great mistakes come, you know, great things you can't even tell that I didn't know what I was doing I feel I did relatively amazing under the circumstances so I believe how the hair goes it goes from longest to shortest I put the longer pieces in the back and then I did the shorter ones coming up I did longer pieces in the front like I took the I took the longer piece from the second um, set of hair because it came in two separate sets of hair like there was this piece that had as long and short piece and then there was this piece that had as long and short piece so I had two different sets I finally realized that it was going from long to short if I can make this wig then you guys could definitely make this wig it's very very it's pretty easy just know just kind of look at the lengths that you want it to go um like i was saying before like i put the long ones here because i wanted to make sure that i had some kind of long piece and then when i got up here um i put the the eight inches and i made sure i crowned it up here because i was like the pieces start to get like very scanty and i was just like oh my god i made it on a wig cap so i could take it off at night so i could do some hair maintenance underneath um this hair is very very flexible and I feel that I could probably shorten the sides some more Let's go, and really take it to another different hairstyle but I'm just enjoying the bowl cut right now I haven't curled it this is the, the way it is naturally um, it's starting to get a little flat it was a lot more curvaceous before but now it's starting to get a little flat so I feel like I need to put the iron to it now. So this is the side profile. This is the back. Not too shabby, huh? Not too shabby. I left the tail because when I take it off, I want to make sure I know where the back from the front was. And that's pretty much it. Do I like this hair so far? Absolutely. I think it's super cute. I think it's super easy and it's definitely a quick weed. All right, all right, all right. I know you're wondering why I have a sock over my mannequin head. It's because the mannequin head is too small for me, so the sock make it bigger. So you're gonna need scissors and glue. You're gonna need the blade with the comb in it. That makes sense, I forgot what those are called. And you're gonna need the weave. This is the Janet Collection Pixie Cut. It's a 99J. This is the 38 pieces. This is what it looks like. It comes in two separate bundles. This is just one. So it also came with a shower cap and a stocking cap. and protects your mannequin head. 
What you will see me here doing is gluing the long pieces in the back. First of all, I would like to apologize for the quality of this video, but this was so easy that anybody could do it. Trust when I say this. So as for the sideburns, what you're going to see me do is layer the tracks right on top of each other. I did four tracks on the side of the mannequin head and I laid them really, really close together, kind of like an invisible part. I, you could do three or four. Doesn't really matter. Depends on how thick you want your sideburns to be. Then I'm going to take my long pieces and I'm just going to glue that to the front. Everything is going around in a circular motion, guys. It is super, super easy to create this wig. All right. And I'm just going to go around in circles. I did the long ones in the front. And then I'm doing um, the medium ones in the back. And I did that all the way to the top of the head. Easy. What I'm going to do is take the 8 inch piece. And I'm going to just go around in a circle. Circle, 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 guys. The, the method is a circle. That's why it's so easy. Then I'm going to take the closure piece. And I'm just going to glue that girl right on the center. <laughs> like yes it is that easy like it is that easy regardless if this video isn't the best now what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut and shape using my razor blade comb and I am shaping it to how I want it to be this is optional like you obviously have the control of how you want it to style I styled it on the mannequin head as much as I could making sure it's framing the face of the mannequin and then I took out the shower cap and I put it on my head and then I combed it her out make sure I know where the shape was for my face and basically framed it to my face like Easy guys, easy as pie. Anybody could do this. And that's about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Mwah.